it's very rare, I, I think, that you that you meet a character that is not either at the nascent stage of their journey or the apex of their journey, like the climax of their journey. I, I, you know, you're meeting a guy who's literally on a Wednesday of the longest week of his life. Like it's the worst Wednesday of his life, and uh, and therefore he's he's mired in this inertia of this Groundhog's Day repetition of, of finding this tomb. And, and, you know, I guess other stories would, would have him finding it for Machiavellian reasons. Um, but, but for this guy, uh, he has been driven, driven mad by this quest um, because he just desperately wants to see his family. You know, for him, uh, this is a relentless quest uh, to find something that he doesn't have much stock in, in, uh, in, in uh, how uh, horrific this disease could be anyway. Right. And, um, and uh, yeah, he's, uh, he will kill anyone and everyone on this island to get what he wants. For me, and, and, and certainly what, I, what I've uh, experienced with uh, Alicia is, is her, her passion for, for storytelling. Mm -hmm. And the story is king. And if the story is king and it's not about you and it's not about your ego or it's not about how you look, uh, then, then, then that's just a winning combination. I hadn't met Alicia before. I, I knew her uh, from, from, uh, through a mutual friend. And, and I thought if we ever got a, the chance to work together, something really special could happen. And literally the very first take that we did inside that tent, I, we looked at each other and said, yeah, yeah, this is gonna be good.